Hi, I'm Lisa Mauer. One of the many gifts of our faith is that it um, attracts us to purpose. And um, we all are searching for purpose, right? That's what we hear all the time is that God has a purpose for our life. We want to matter. And we want to be connected to something that matters. The tough thing now, though, is that our world, what we're going through, our world is really turned upside down. And um, that can absolutely build fear within us. And this fear can become bigger than the reality of what we're dealing with. And the problem with that for me is that fear can interfere with my pursuit of purpose. Last year's women's retreat was beautiful. It, uh, Kelly Walquist was with us. She is a very accomplished author and Catholic speaker. And um, there were lots of takeaways last year. But one of the two things, two of the things that she said that really resonated with me were when she talked about walking in the dust of our rabbi and also staying so close to our Lord that we would remain in his shadow. And those words from her brought me back to one of my favorite gospel stories, gospel um, passages, which uh, comes from Mark, Mark 5, 25. And that's the woman who was hemorrhaging, right? And this woman had um, been to so many doctors and had suffered so much, um, but she had the courage to get into that crowd and pursue our Lord and get close enough to reach out and touch him. And um, that's always just been something that I have thought about and prayed about and again, just admired her courage. But the story doesn't stop there. She reached out and she touched our Lord and she was healed. But what did our Lord do? He turned around and he said, who touched me? He wanted to see her. He wanted to know her. And she did come forward at that point. And what did she do? She fell at his feet in fear and trembling. And then I love the last line there. It talks about how she told him the whole story. So um, our Lord was busy, right? He was busy trying to get somewhere else, but he took the time. It's always about the encounter with our Lord Jesus. So our retreat this year, uh, the theme is perfect love drives out all fear. The same theme uh, for our parish. And um, I'm really looking forward to seeing Kelly Walquist again. She will be back with us again. And uh, looking forward to hearing her message. But I'm also looking forward to another opportunity to be with my sisters in the shadow and the embrace of our God. To receive his love, to return his love, and certainly to share his love. So I would invite you to come to the retreat. Um, Share your blessings and be blessed.